Now, the rufous-necked hornbill is a unique bird. You've probably seen it on television. Its reddish-brown neck and head are hard to miss. Now, where can you find this unique bird? Mostly in India and Southeast Asia. You could also see them in Nepal, but only 200 years ago. Nepal's last rufous-necked hornbill was spotted in 1829. But almost two centuries later, it's made a stunning return. Take a look at our next report. The rufous-necked hornbill last seen in Nepal almost 200 years ago. This bird was thought to be extinct here until this man photographed it in December. For wildlife photographer Devin Carroll, this is the greatest achievement of his career. He found and photographed a pair of male rufous-necked hornbills, a bird that was last spotted here in 1829. There are several species of hornbill found in Nepal. The great hornbill, the oriental pied hornbill, the Indian grey hornbill and this latest find, the rufous-necked hornbill. The male has reddish-brown head, neck and underparts, while the female is all black in colour. The rufous-necked hornbill were believed to be locally extinct in Nepal due to hunting and habitat loss. But this new discovery is an indicator of the good health of forests in the Himalayan nation. The rufous-necked hornbill is categorised as vulnerable by the International Union for Conservation of Nature. These birds are non-migratory and monogamous in nature. They nest in natural holes and hollows of old tall trees. They require large swathes of forests with huge trees for nesting. So their presence is an indicator of good forest health. These birds were once threatened by habitat degradation, fragmentation, deforestation and pet trade. However, it looks like the conservation efforts have paid off with this sighting of the rufous-necked hornbill. It looks like the birds are returning to the forests of Nepal. South Asia Bureau, we on. World is one.